hello friends welcome back uh, so friends today's demonstration uh, the today's session we will discuss regarding how you can implement the global and local variable in your flow service okay so let's start the demo very first we are creating a global variable and those particular global variable we are using in our flow service okay so here yes, setting option is available so go to settings click on global variables here key value is password and delete option is available so click on add global variable and here you can mention the key and value pair okay so key you can mention as a concat and value you can mention as a successful then click on save changes if you want to mention the password you can mention the password as well in password format key and value if you don't want then unselect the checkbox and you can see key as a concat and value as a successful and click on the save changes option okay so those things like those value i want to employ like use in my flow service so how you can do that just open the designer here i am creating one folder as a global variable demo one click on finish here we are creating one flow service click on right click new flow service Give the user defined name as a get global variable. Then click on finish. Here empty flow got created. Now for error handling, we are using a try cache block. Okay, and in this try block, we are uh, like using one concat function. So click on insert. Here you can check the concat function is already used or not. If it's not, then you can invoke separately. Okay. The concat function is not there. So what I do? Click on invoke. Go to your WM public package. And here see string function is available so go to string and uh, select this concat function this is a one way otherwise you can just type and check this particular function is available or not okay so concat function is available click on ok so now uh, this function pub dot string concat uh, is in hook so in input output we are taking one input as a string one output as a result and click on save save option okay so now you can uh, manipulate the pipeline so string one we are mapping to string one and uh, in string you can mention as a course Okay, so you are AC course then click on ok here value you can drop this is unwanted variable string you can drop this is unwanted variable we already took one variable result but this variable is not showing in pipeline why because we already like this uh, after that stay this step we have another step that's why we're not able to manipulate the pipeline in that case you can disable the another step now you can manipulate the pipeline the result option is available okay so you can map this result to value to result in string we don't require you can draw in string 2 we don't require we can drop okay now you can save the demo after that i'm taking one map step here just copy 
and paste it here and this is extra map step you can drop okay yeah did it now in this map step what we do here the result is available so first we are uh, like printing the global variable and then we are check for a local variable okay so take one string and so success and here double click on this uh, success string give the value as a percent percent and we already discuss regarding the uh, so this is a concat this is our key we can directly copy and paste it here in percent percent sign okay and click on this particular option perform global variable substitution click on ok after that do click on save button and again take uh, another map step here uh, take another I want to print a local variable so get another string uh, do the user define name as a local variable and this local variable we are printing this result so in percent 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 here you can type the local variable print the result so in pipeline variable result the particular value get printed so here click on the local pipeline variable substitution click on ok after that click on save button again we are taking one map step here and i want to uh, show you if you select global and local variable as well then output what will be the output okay so again take another string global and local okay global and local variable so here double click and the percent percent so success and result okay so success value and uh, result value i want to print success In percent percent result Mm, select both o both options okay and then click on ok after that enable to complete your code enable this uh, cache block and here take inbuilt service get last error to get all the information yeah, all the error related information okay so in hope insert get last error okay so in this map step those variable you require you can take otherwise unwanted variable you can drop and this is try block this is cache block so now you can run this particular flow so run as a flow service string value you can give as a manage okay. click on ok after that so result you can see here the manage course success successful local variable this is a look in local variable we printed the result as a manage course so global and local variable the successful manage course the successful manage course so i want to see one output here go to your pipeline click on this map step 
so here we are taking the different different variable okay so instead of taking different different variable this map state we did the global and local variable success and result and this map state we are doing the local variable in the result okay so i just want to show you if the global and local variable you print like selected all the check boxes do not open so what we do we can add another global variable give the re name as a result same name as your local variable result here in the value as a 10 okay and then click on save changes and in this global and local variable what we do we will delete this and in this map step this map step local variable and this map step we are taking one string Local and local variable. Okay. So in person person type the result. So if you selected both checkbox, then it will not take your global variable, it will take your pipeline variable. So I'll take local variable because this is a priority. If you select both checkboxes, then it will take only local variable. And if you uncheck the local variable substitution and select the global variable, then that time global variable substitution will pop up. Okay. So click on OK. Save the flow and run the service. Run as a flow service. Manage. This is our input. And here you can see the global and local variable. It will take the local variable value like result this is local variable value like pipeline variable value it will not take the global variable value why because this is a priority in flow service if you take the local variable and global variable as well it will take only the local variable not a global variable so guys that's all about today's demonstration if you like this video then don't forget to subscribe like share and comment we will come up with a new session very soon till the time stay happy stay connected and thank you so much